How to save a web page as PDF on the iPad. Let's dive right in. First of all, I'm going to show you how to do this on the Safari browser. And then I'm also going to show you how to do this in Google Chrome on the iPad. So first of all, open up Safari. Then head over to the web page that you would like to save. In my case, this is the New York Times. Then to save the web page as a PDF in Safari, tap on the share icon in the upper right corner of the screen. Scroll down. Select markup. Now here you could use one of these pens here to leave some markup on the page. But if you don't want to do that, then that's completely fine as well. Because we can also just save it as is. Then just tap on done in the upper right corner of the screen. And tap on save file too. Now under location here, set the location where you would like to save the web page as a PDF. In my case, I will leave this on, on my iPad. And then to finalize the process, just tap here on save in the upper right corner of the screen. Now we can go back to the home screen and open up the files app. If you can't find the files app, you can also just swipe down with one finger from the middle of your iPad and then search for files. You should then find the files app here, then tap on it. Then here on the left side under locations, make sure to choose the location where you chose to save the PDF before. And sure enough, we have our web page now saved as a PDF here. Let's verify. Perfect. Now let me also show you how to save a web page as PDF in the Google Chrome browser on the iPad. For this purpose, first of all, we're going to open up Google Chrome. Then we head over to the web page that we would like to save as a PDF. Then we tap on share in the upper right corner of the screen. Then we go to print. Don't worry, we're not actually going to print this, but we need to do it like this in order to save our web page as a PDF. With that said, now here in the upper right corner, we tap on the share icon. Then we tap on save to files. We can give it a name if you want here. And once again, under locations here, make sure to choose the location where you would like to save the PDF. And once that is done, on the upper right, tap on save. Now let us go to the files app. We will open it up from here. Remember, you can also just swipe down one finger from the middle of the screen and then search for the files app by typing files. Then you can open it up from here. Make sure the location here is correct. And sure enough, we have our Google Chrome web page now saved here as a PDF. Perfect. And this is how you save a web page as a PDF on the iPad. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe for more iPad tutorials.